Hello, everybody. Welcome back to stream. So this is Hugh Tao's makeup look. Did the little ghosty and the flowers. Uh, this look was requested by Yoru Prince Knight. So this is for you. But let's go, let's go pull for Klee and let's play the summer event. Okay, I have 20 wishes saved up. Let's just do this. Let's just do this. Okay. Good luck. Good luck. Okay, okay. Okay. Okay, keep going, keep going. Keep going, keep going. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Why are they all weapons? <gasps> to commit arson. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh. oh, that makes me happy. <gasps> what the? What? What is happening? What is, what, is, what, is, what, is, what is? Is the universe looking out for me? Is that what is happening? somebody's good side right now. Ah, child. <laughs> She's so, her little hop. She's so cute. Okay, <laughs> I have to do this. Okay, wait till midnight. Wait till midnight. Explosion inside city wall. Grounded be thy woe. Explosions can hurt people. Gene can be dreadful. Mondstadt be bombed, Klee be doomed. Those are the survival mm. rules that the Knights of Favonius gave me. Mondstadt be bombed? Klee? Klee? <laughs> My girl? <laughs> <sighs> Shame I only get to listen in from the other side of the window and don't get to join in the debate. I don't care. I'd love to give my two cents. Nobody wants to hear hey, your what? two cents. What's up? What's up? Paimon wants in. Paimon, you little tea sipper. Recently, all the customers at the tavern have been debating the exact same topic. Who is the strongest fighter in Mondstadt? Well, obviously it's Jean because Jean is the one who's the the sit-in grand the strongest master. Strongest fighter. Jean. Jean, 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 Jean. Wow, then it really must be tough to become the strongest of all. But anyway, nah. is there like the general agreement in the city on who it is, or? Who is it? <laughs> expecting people to come to a swift and straightforward consensus in the city of freedom is like expecting fishermen's toast to drop out of the sky. Paimon would enjoy that very much. Everyone's she would love their own it opinion, to drop out of the sky. Backed up by a unique set of cherry-picked information. But let's well, I mean, be if we're going off of my own opinion, we all know who so I would choose. And entertaining. Mainstream opinion is polarized, with most people supporting one of two candidates. Okay, who are the two candidates? One is the Dandelion Knight. The other is the Dark Knight Hero. Wait. I'm thinking Kaya is the dandelion knight just because he likes dandelion wine. But is that is is he the dandelion knight? Is that really his name, the dandelion knight? <laughs> Please tell me that is Jean's name, the dandelion knight, and not Kaya. <laughs> Please. Please tell me. <laughs> oh, oh, Paimon votes for you. 
<laughs> Thank you, Paimon. Okay, it is G. Good. <laughs> Maybe we'll pick up some juicy gossip. <laughs> Can you imagine Kaya being called the Dandelion Knight? <laughs> Good. That fits Jean a lot better. Because Jean's thing is like the dandelions to ascend her. So that makes sense. That makes sense. But for Kai, I'm just like, how did that happen? But poor him, he's not even in the running. I'll vote for you. I'll vote oh, for you, my man. I do envy your life of leisure. My life of leisure? Are you insane? I do literally everything around here. Uh, don't mind Have you me, seen of anything I've done? <sighs> I guess I'll just... Get back to work. Yeah, get back to work. Blech. Talk to me, sir. I'm a child in the tavern. Don't you, like, have to tell me to get out? Talk to me! What'll it be oh. today? I'm sorry. We are very close together. The strongest fighter. I don't pay much attention to that sort of thing. Huh. Pilot Just tell me. bartenders had some kind of special information sources. Yeah. Exactly. That's what Paimon was getting at. <laughs> I have no involvement in any intelligence gathering operation. Oh but if goodness. you made me pick someone, it would be the Dark Knight hero. Ah, I hate, I hate, I hate the name the Dark Knight hero. I've heard some stories about him. Apparently, Every he once rescued a city in my dweller body. from the Abyss Order. Hate it. He didn't do it. I did it. That Here was me! The barman's top secret intelligence! Speaking the audacity! The order, their minions are really stirring up trouble all over the place, aren't they? Just huh? tell me who the strongest- Most macho in Mondstadt. Yes, She's please. a little girly who wears red. Me? It's Klee! That's right. I found this out one day about half a month ago, when I went up to the Stormbear Mountains looking for inspiration for my new song. <laughs> he thinks Klee is the strongest, how cute! Guess what happened? She burned, blew up everything. I witnessed the most powerful destructive force I have ever seen in my life. I'm telling you, it completely changed the whole landscape in that part of the mountains. Clee, no. Holy I was hiding behind a bush and I saw this little girl no. running into the distance, leaving a trail of destruction in her wake. Oh my goodness. <laughs> yeah, she's so chaotic. But I don't know if anyone will believe me. I believe. <laughs> now that you mention it, the idea of a tiny little girl wielding that much destructive power is a little far-fetched. Oh my God, that is. <laughs> you want to know what I think? Can you just I imagine going up in the mountains? Nobody else knows about. <laughs> and you just see a little girl completely changing the shape of a mountain because she is so strong. That is terrifying. I would just be like, you do you, girl. I'm gonna I'm gonna be over here. <laughs> Please just like her mom. Do we meet her mom? That would be fun. Like a daughter and what is it? Daughter, mommy daughter. Maybe even the most powerful treasure in all of Mondstadt. Did you Please, say the treasure? most powerful treasure? Did Paimon imagine that or did you hear it too? I it's heard it too. Just a guess. I mean No. It's a bard's razor sharp into a razor. I'll take you Thank at you, your amigo. word. Ah, I am so happy to meet a true amigo. I'm an amiga, Ooh, not an amigo. So this girl, what's her name? Uh, Clay. I, I do not know her name. Mm. I do not see her often in Mondstadt. Cause she's off blowing things I, up. I'm telling the truth. You got. Hmm. Doesn't sound like. But thanks for your it. I'm right in front of you. One thing. Everyone if has an opinion. Everyone's got their own opinion and can't be persuaded. How are we ever going to find out who Mondstadt's strongest fighter is? Competition. Everyone's got it. Let's go see what Jean says. Oh. If the knights have got an official ranking table for this kind of thing. Guess you think I'll be on there? They counted I'm an honorary knight. Don't worry, though. Paimon has full confidence in your abilities. What if I'm the strongest? I mean, I'm from another world, another dimension. Jean! Jean! Nobody in here with you, Jean? That's suspicious. Oh, man! 
Say something. Dean, sorry to bother you. We're collecting intel on the strongest fighter in Mondstadt. Well, obviously she's gonna say herself. Actually, no, I think Jean would be humble. Do you have, uh, one of those official Knights of Favonius verified ranking table thingies? Yeah, but you need, like, an outside source to do that, because if you're ranking yourself, you're obviously gonna put yourself first, unless you're, like, super-duper humble. But, like, even when you're super-duper humble, you still wanna be, like, the best, you know? Strongest fighter in Mondstadt? Huh. I am sorry, but I cannot help. I do not have any Why? relevant documentation on that topic. It's been so long since I've heard your voice, Jean. I missed you. Oh, well that sucks. <laughs> Mama was hoping she would at least make the top five. I'm in the top three. What are you talking about? <laughs> well, although I do not have the data to make such an assessment, I will say that my faith in our honorary knight's abilities has never wavered. Thank you. Which reminds me. Oh no. Don't ask me to do something Recently, else. Recently, one of the Abyss Order's mages has been active near the city. Although he is keeping a low profile. I'll go handle it. Don't around worry. Mondstadt, please be on the lookout for danger. Given your Got it. Well, high-ranking fighting strength, I trust you will be able to help keep the area safe. Nothing to worry about because we got Klee here. We got Klee on our side. Oh. Who's gonna be here? <gasps> Klee! Huh? Oh! Hello. Are you? Oh no! Don't cry! Don't cry! Don't cry! Hi. Are you okay? Huh? What is it? Is she? She sounds like a little puppy. I, I'm fine. I'm not hurt. Sorry for bumping into you. It's okay. Here you go. Oh, explosion! Oh, she—it's like a mantra for her. She has to. She has to remind herself all the time. Kai is so close to finding out Venti is the animal archon. Oh, can you imagine? Can you imagine if he found out? I feel like he would be baffled. He would be like, "You? It's you?" And Venti would just be like, "Yes, sir." And Kai would just be like. My whole life is a lie. <laughs> There's some writing on here. Explosion inside city wall. Grounded be Grounded thy, thy woe. Explosions can, can hurt, hurt people. people. Jean can be dreadful. Jean must Monster scold her a bond? lot. Klee be doomed? So if Mon if Monsac gets bombed, Klee is gonna be in big trouble. And since Klee is obviously afraid of Jean, she's like, I don't want that. I don't want that Thanks. at all. Mr. Kaya wrote these down for me. Um, they're, um, survival rules. <gasps> He's a dad! He, oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> he wrote them for her! Oh! Where, I, where's my ring? Right here, wait, no, that's my right hand. Right here, sir! Please, just right here! I will accept it right now. Oh my. Oh. How adorable. Thank you, Mr. Kaya. <laughs> Mr. Kaya. Rules. <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, rules that I must absolutely never break under any circumstances. Yeah, do not bomb on stat. Otherwise, something terrible would happen. He writes like this. How cute. He he wrote a little poem for her. Yep. Uh, it hurts. Ah, I forgot to introduce myself. Yeah, come on, Clee. My name <laughs> is Clee. Hi, Clee. My name is Andrea. Paimon's name is... Well, Paimon. Well, that's what happens when you speak in third person, Paimon. You kind of give away your name literally all the I time. I all about you guys. You're the honorary knight who helps Mondstadt. Wow. More recognition. Yay. Paimon is so happy right now. I heard it from Amber. But wait, no. There's oh, no she time friends for with just right all the knights. <laughs> I'm dealing with a big emergency. I grabbed my map and ran as fast as I could all the What's way around? here. The, the treasure I buried in the Whispering Woods. It's 
gone. Who stole her treasure? I will absolutely, absolutely hunt them down and punish them. Don't cry, Klee. Buried treasure? Paimon, it's not for you. It's for her. Exactly what Paimon was thinking. Lost Don't you dare, Paimon. Let us Don't. Help you find it. Yay! Thanks, you guys. You're Here. welcome. Here's where the map says the treasure should be. I Got put it. a circle around it. I also okay. put a wooden sign in the ground at the place oh. where I buried it to make it We saw this to before. Paimon is starting to understand how this treasure went missing so easily. Yeah, she did put a sign on in front of her treasure like, there's treasure here. Shh. Come on, <laughs> Miss Honorary Knight. Let's go. Don't do that to me. Don't you dare. I don't. I can't take it. <laughs> She's just absolutely too cute.